Power is first generated at the utility at around 100,000 volts. It comes to a local substation where it is stepped down by large transformers to around 12,000 volts. At this point, it comes onto the fairgrounds on lines that we call the primary, which in this case are buried underground. It's an approximate total of 11,000 kilowatts, 4,000 kilowatt of generated power for amusement rides on the midway, and 7,000 kilowatts of utility power that is available on the fairgrounds. This is about the same amount of power used by all the homes and businesses in a suburb like Brandon. It takes well over 100,000 feet of wire and cable to get power to all of the end users. These connections range in amperage from a single 120 volt outlet, like in your home, to 400 amps of three phase for a large carnival ride. Every single wire, cable, and outlet is installed and tested in 26 days by a crew of 12 skilled technicians. It takes a great team to make the electric safe and solid here at the fair. Our payoff in the end is realizing the product of integration of great staff and technology and bringing this year's Florida State Fair to our patrons.